What's up, guys? Welcome back. Um, Miata is, uh, everything's taken care of. Like I said in the last video, um, I'm gonna be, oh, it's so dark in here, you guys can barely see me. Um, so I'm gonna be, uh, I'm gonna be getting rid of that motor. So, like I had said, I wasn't sure what I was gonna do. Um, some plans have changed, and, uh, yeah. I'm gonna introduce you guys to the new motor. Some of you might be disappointed, some of you might be like, cool swap, bro. This is a GM out of a Chevy 2.2 liter Ecotec motor. Now the history behind this is I have a friend in the Miata community who bought the swap kit, uh, didn't end up using it, and I picked it up for a really good price. He got the motor out of a 2008 Chevy HHR. I, um, I would have preferred to go with the 2.4, but the 2.2 liter is good enough for me at the moment. Um, if I want to go with the 2.4 down the road, it's really easy to pull this out and put all the components on that. So, um, this is going to be my baseline. Now, for anybody who's familiar with the swap kit, it comes with engine mounts, the bell housing adapter, a um, couple adapters or spacers for the coolant ports and things like that. But it's a very basic swap, um, a little bit of wiring. Uh, some little modifications here and there, but it's literally like a drop-in kit. It's probably the easiest swap you can do. Um, honestly, going to a VVT motor was probably more work. Um, and I'm getting 0.4 more liters. Um, this block is pretty solid for boost, so uh, I'm probably going to be looking for a supercharger or a turbo. This is going to be my big plan. So I'll let you know what the engine bay looks like. So this is kind of where I'm at. I've been pulling a lot of the old electrical components out of the way. Um, getting the engine bay cleaned up. It's kind of a mess right now. Um, Got to tidy up some wiring. Got to get the old or the new wiring harness for that motor ready to go in here. Yeah, so I got a really good deal on all the components. Um, it basically came with a new transmission, a new clutch, the engine, um, all the components needed besides. Uh, the throttle pedal, so you swap a GM throttle pedal, this is, it's electronic, so it's drive by, drive by wire, not drive by cable. So I'm converting it to drive by cable, converting it to drive by wire, not cable. So uh, I've actually got that in the car already, I welded that up. Um, I've been slacking on the video, so. Check it out, guys. Yeah, boy. What's going on, everybody? Welcome to my V... Not my VVT swap, because that's that's overdone. This is an Ecotech swap. So, I didn't really film, like, anything. 